Dear students, I am Rabia Kamran on behalf of my YouTube channel Chalo Padho with Rabia. Uh, today I am in front of you students and teachers with a fun hands-on activity. इससे पहले भी हम आपके लिए बहुत अच्छी अच्छी एक्टिविटीज लेकर आए थे और आज जो एक्टिविटी हम करेंगे वो रिलेटेड है अल्जब्रा डिस्क से एक्चुअली इन प्राइमरी स्कूल वी हैव लर्न हाउ टू एड एंड सब्ट्रैक्ट पॉजिटिव नंबर्स हाउ एवर फॉर सब्ट्रैक्शन वी हैव ओनली लर्न हाउ टू सब्ट्रैक्ट अ स्मॉल पॉजिटिव नंबर फ्रॉम अ ग्रेटर पॉजिटिव नंबर फॉर एग्जाम्पल फाइव माइनस टू दिस इज थ्री नाइन माइनस सेवन दिस इज टू गॉट इट हेयर वी विल लर्न हाउ टू कैरी आउट एडिशन एंड सब्ट्रैक्शन दैट इन्वॉल्व नेगेटिव नंबर यूजिंग एल्जिप्रा डिस्क so these are algebra disks which i have made uh, by cutting the heart sheets in circular form all these are heart sheets and then i have laminated it with laminated sheet got it and there are two sides one side is one and another side on back side of this number this is negative 1 this is front and this is back To obtain the negative of one, we flip the disk with the number one as shown. If we flip this one, it will be converted into negative one. So we can show that negative of one is negative one. What is this? Actually, this negative shows flipping over the disk. We are flipping it so that we will apply this negative sign on one. And after flipping this, we will get negative one, so that would be negative one. If I am having negative one over here, and if I will flip over this negative one, what it would be? You can see that that would be one. So how would I write it? Negative of negative one is equal to positive one. What happens if we put two disks, positive one and negative one, together? Let's see what it would be. We will write here like this: one plus negative one. What it would be? That would be zero. If we add positive one and negative one, that would be zero. We will get a zero pair. So that. This pair is called zero pair. We can use three disks to represent the number three as. Let's see, positive one, one, two, and this is three. Three is equal to one plus one plus one. If we use three negative disks, one, two. Three. What it would be? That would be negative three is equal to negative one means this disk plus negative one means this disk plus negative one means this disk. To obtain the negative of three, that is negative of three. There are three disks which are positive. And after flipping over, we will get three disks of negative one, which shows negative three. So negative one, negative one, and negative one. That would be negative three. So if it is written over there, negative of three, that will be equal to negative of three. These negative of three. Got it? To obtain the negative. Of negative three, how will you find out? We flip the three negative one disks. You can see that there are three negative one disks. There would be, and you will flip over it. The sign which is outside this bracket, you have to flip over. If it is negative, you have to flip over. So how would you solve that? Now you can see that these three disks. Show this negative three. Negative three means negative one, negative one, negative one. And this sign outside the bracket it shows flipping over of these disks. So what it would be? 
I will put it like this. One, two, three. So we can write it like that. This is positive three. Answer would be positive three. You are flipping. So you will write here flip. Actually, what happens if we put three one this and three negative one this together? So three positive this and three negative this. Side by side, I am putting positive and negative this. We write three positive plus we are adding them. And these are three negative. Got it? And what it would be? Let's see. This is, we have already told you, this is one zero pair. This is one zero pair. And this is also one zero pair. How many zero pairs are here? Three zero pairs. Every positive one will cancel this negative one. So what it would be? Zero, zero pair, zero pair and zero pair. Your answer would be zero. Clear? We will get zero pairs. Can you give another example of a zero pair? Now we are going to take some examples of addition over here. Example 5 plus negative 2. Actually, I am calling it plus because operation is in between 5 and negative 2. And this is not minus. This is the identification of 2 or identity of 2 which is negative. Got it? Negative 2 means 2 units towards left on number 9. So, how will we solve that? We will take 5 positive like this. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Negative 2 means I will take this negative, negative. Make the 0 pairs. This is 1 0 pair. And you can see that this is one zero pair and this is another zero pair. There are two zero pairs, so they will cancel to each other. So what it would be then? This is zero pairs. So your answer would be, what are remaining this? These three discs are remaining and these four discs are cancelling to each other. So what it would be your answer? One. 2 that will go from here to there that would be 3. Now second question negative 5 plus 2. How will you solve that? The same method first of all we will take 5 negatives 1 2 3 in the previous question what we have done, we have added a positive number in a negative number. So, but here, what we are doing, we are doing the same, but negative 5 first and positive 2 afterwards. So, how will we solve that? This is positive 2. I will put it over here, positive 2. We have put 5 negative ones and 2 positive ones. So, the same process. I will make two zero pairs over there. These three negative discs will go over there and your answer would be negative one, negative one, negative one. And how will you show that? That would be negative three. This is negative five plus negative two. So here you can see that both the numbers are negative. How will we perform this method? Negative 5 means I am putting here this negative 5, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 plus, plus negative 2. So I will put here negative 2. You cannot cut any number there is no zero pair why because all the discs are negative so what will we do here 
he will go towards after adding them that would be how many dis are here seven dis and all are negative so your answer would be negative seven now we will discuss the answers of three questions first one we have solved five plus negative two is equal to three and negative five plus two is equal to what negative three and when you take negative five and negative two you are going to add that would be negative seven what have you seen you have seen that when there are two numbers and the bigger number is with positive sign and the smaller number is with negative sign so if you apply the operation in between these numbers you are adding them your answer would be positive got it and you will be subtracting the smaller number from the bigger number and your answer would be positive clear but if the bigger number is with negative sign and the smaller number is with positive sign your answer would be negative and you will subtract both the numbers you can see that you are adding here because plus sign is over here but actually what will you be doing you will be subtracting 5 minus 2 that is 3 and your sign would be negative nazar aapko aa raha hoga ki asal mein kar aap add rahe hain theek hai lekin jab dono signs different hongi you will be subtracting the absolute values got it jo bada number hoga uski sign yahan hai yahan bade number ki sign kya thi negative thi wo yahan par aa gayi theek hai if both the numbers are having same signs and both the signs are negative your answer would be in negative and you will be adding both the absolute values do ke andar hum subtract kar rahe hote hain absolute values ko aur yahan hum add kar rahe hote hain 5 plus 2 7 and both the signs are same so that would be negative sign that's it